you know, this is such an inspirational story, and we're very blessed. David joins us today, and he insists he's not a victim. He's a survivor. David, please come join us. Amazing. I'm looking good. Thank you. Nice to meet you. I was going to say, I'm hanging out here with two GQ studs. Look at this. Pleasure. Look at this. Pleasure. Color coordinated, too. You know, and, and first things first, Dave, you go by Dave Dave? Yes, that's my legal name. And you changed your name after this all happened. Why? About two years ago, I changed it legally to Dave Dave uh, to liberate myself uh, from my father and to establish myself as an artist. It was kind of like an artistic decision to, to do that. And a lot of people will look at someone who's been burned and they think, okay, you know, physically, okay, I'm not seeing skin like I normally would on someone, but what a lot of people don't realize is what a toll it takes physically and the amount of pain. I wanted to talk with you briefly because one of the reasons we we're excited to have you on the show is you're finally at a point in your life where pain no longer dictates it. Almost. Currently, I'm undergoing a treatment uh, called calamari, which is a it's a it's a it's a it's a machine that they attach and it has electrodes on it. What it does is it it, sc it scatters the messages to the brain to shut off the pain centers in the brain in those areas, and it's absolutely amazing. It's changed my life for the better. And it's helped control Amazing. the pain. I, I wanted to bring in really quickly in this discussion on the phone, Dr. Ward Wagner, one of Dave Dave's pain management specialists. And Dave Dave just described how his treatment has been helping him. Is, is this something that you're using more commonly in some of your chronic pain patients? You know, we use this quite often uh, for, for many different types of uh, pain conditions. The conditions that respond the best are conditions that, that are what we call neurogenic or neuropathic. Uh, in other words, if there's current tissue damage happening, it's not going to be much help. But your neuropathy patients, your post-chemo, post-shingles, and now, of course, we've learned burn survivors, these kinds of people this is tremendous for. And, and this, this also, you can harken back to this. I, I think what's great about new treatment modalities is being able to pull back on use of sedatives and narcotics and other standard pain management treatments. You're absolutely right. The people that I meet on a day-to-day -day basis are on so many narcotic pain meds, they're in danger for their lives. Their, their brains are like soup. They can't think straight anymore with uh, short-term memory loss. So, so yes, my goal is to help get people off of all those adverse side effects. Well, Dr. Ward, thank you for highlighting some of these new treatments. We really appreciate it. You're such a role model, Dave. Dave, Dave. Um, talk a little bit, Dave, about the role of art as a therapy, especially for people who have been burned. I think art is an expression that we all have. And uh, whether or not we, I think we're all human beings and we all have different emotions and different feelings. However, we all have different challenges and different things to deal with. Currently, I'm showing at, at Joseph Watson Gallery and the Eden Fine Art Gallery in Las Vegas. And I'm just living the life of an artist and building a brand. Is there anything before you go, David, that you want to leave people with? I think I, my, my brand, it's lifted and it's, it's I made it, I, I created it to inspire others to live their life at an elevated level. And uh, I believe that through doing that, we become healthier people and better individuals. Wow. Thank you. I keep living life and I've asked them, keep doing what you're doing. Thank you so much for joining us today.